the second best in qualification, the Olympic champion from Rio, Eleftherios Petrunius. A gymnast who is seeking a place at the Olympics and in a fashion that is less dramatic than last time when he only just made it right at the end. Pushes up into a very horizontal planche, lovely. And then drops down below the rings, up into the Maltese with the fingers pointed. Incredible. Jonasson, that's as level a shoulder presentation as you'll see. Again, arms open in the Maltese. Terrific handstand. He's looking good. Lovely planche once more. Holding it for the clear two seconds is vital. Iron cross with beautiful geometry. Beautiful symmetry. Has to slightly adjust the handstand, but by centimetres. He doesn't have to adjust his dismount. It's brilliant. Oh, that's a look of immense relief for Eleftherios Petrunius, the 32-year-old from Athens. From Greece, the birthplace of the Olympics, and the man who calls the games home might have earned himself a place. And the Greek flag is flying high around the arena. That is tremendous. Super performance from him. Nailed that landing on the double-twisting double back. 32 years old. 2016 Olympic champion, 2020 Olympic bronze. He went Olympics. to the Tokyo Olympics, won the bronze. Just beautiful gymnastically. Scores on its way. He leads 15.066. Eleftherios Petrunius. Wow, wow, wow. 15.06. The world champion on three occasions. Next will be two-time Olympic medalist, including the runner-up at the Olympic and Games in Tokyo. The People's Republic of China, Zhao Hao. Yo Hao of the People's Republic of China. A medalist on rings at the World Championships as well. He's got such a collection of honours. His scoring qualification, 14.8. Very elegantly and powerfully opens up into the diagonal hands or the uh, horizontal armed handstand. Level position in the planche, really nice. So good level Maltese as well. Steady, still handstand. And the layout work, which is so nice to see on the rings. Great geometry to this routine. Jonasson, elegant Jonasson, that's lovely, into the Iron Cross. Not quite as perfectly horizontal by his own high standards on that Maltese, but it's very uh, smaller difference. His handstand again looks steady. His dismount was a little on the compressed side, slightly piked, but it was a very well-performed routine. And it is going to be a contender for a place on the podium, one imagines. And he can keep his mind on a potential place on the podium with that number, 14.833. He gains two tenths of difficulty from qualification. He loses... And now for the People's Republic of China. But for Liu how long Yang. will he lead? Here is the Olympic champion in the top qualifier, Liu Yang. His execution score in qualifying was an extraordinary 8.8. .8.
into the horizontal armed handstand and another and it really is horizontal <coughs> completely inverted iron cross Maltese position thorough Yamawaki with a good tight tuck points the toes nicely back in the Maltese Very poised, isn't it? <coughs> the dismount is another outstanding one. Yu Yang, he just does this so beautifully. The 29 year old from Liaoning, who attended the prestigious Beijing Sport University. And who is going to be on a prestigious world championship podium based on that display? And Athelios Petrunius leading on 15.066. Liu Yang with a performance of such high quality. And he goes into the gold medal position 15.233. Now, I should just say that from Petrunius's perspective, it doesn't impact Olympic qualification for him, where he needs to win that mini tournament of the five, and there's only one of those left. It's Nikita Simonov. Classified results in the men's rings competition. Bronze to Yo Hao of the People's Republic of China. Silver to Eleftherios Petrunius of Greece. A crucial result for his Paris 2024 prospects. And Liu Yang of the People's Republic of China, the Olympic champion, He's also the world champion going into Paris.